Well, a good Monday afternoon, everyone. We had quite the beautiful weekend. Temperatures were warm. There was plenty, plenty full sunshine, but that changes as we head into the rest of the week. Right now, temperatures in the 80s, 84 in Raynell, 85 over in Fayetteville. We're at 88 in Linside, and we're near 90 over in the coal field. So pretty warm out there. The warm temperatures won't leave us, so it'll still feel like summer, but we're gonna have an unsettled pattern of rain as we head through the rest of the week. Now dry on the radar right now, and that continues overnight, but as we go into Tuesday, the rain chances do return. So starting tomorrow, that unsettled pattern begins and pretty much lasts through the rest of the week. Now with the unsettled weather, we will have the humidity start to spike up. You can see going into Tuesday, you see that spike overnight from tonight into Tuesday. You will feel it outside tomorrow and it will pretty much continue as we head into the latter portion of the week and into next weekend. But it is still summer, so this is something we can expect, especially as we head through the rest of August. Now, future cast not picking up anything overnight. We're still staying clear, maybe a couple clouds, partly cloudy skies. Even early into Tuesday, we're still going to have the sunshine, not a complete washout by any means as we head into your Tuesday. But as we go later in the day, we get some showers. They could, they're going to be fairly scattered, nothing overly widespread. There might be people who don't see any rain, but if you do see some rain, it could be heavy at times. We could have some pretty heavy rain start to move through. You can see going into the latter portion of the day on Tuesday. But going into Wednesday, we clear out again overnight. And it looks like on Wednesday, we'll have some more clouds to start out the day. Still warm, but we have those pockets of sunshine. And as the sun starts to heat the surface, we'll get those storms start to pop up. Nothing severe, really, at times. Really just some stronger, heavier downpours is what the main threat here. So we could see some flooding in some areas. But again, it's not going to be overly widespread and pretty scattered at times. Just very unsettled. Going into Tuesday, again, the chances aren't overly high. We have that chance of rain. It's not going to be widespread. But as we go overnight Wednesday, we start to see those chances start to spike up again. And you can see as we head into the day on Wednesday, it starts to really move up into that scattered to widespread category as we head into the day on Wednesday. So tomorrow, if you're thinking about bringing an umbrella, it won't, wouldn't be the worst idea, but it doesn't look like the day that you'll necessarily really need it out there, especially if you're only quickly passing through outside, maybe walking into the grocery store. Tonight, temperatures in the 60s, 66 in Hinton, 66 over here in Oak Hill, and we're still around 70 in Oceana, so really mild night and the humidity starts to build up overnight. And going over the next couple of days, you see that we keep those, those warm temperatures into the 80s, but we bring back those storm chances and they last through the end of the week.